Welcome, my adventurers and friends, to Let's Talk. Today's topic, riding the roller coaster. Let's dive in. I know we all have hobbies we enjoy, at least I hope we all do. And if you don't, please look into getting some. Activities that take us to another place and bring us to an inner sanction of peace, tranquility, serenity, an escape from everyday life, all the stresses. Sometimes you just need to get off life's roller coaster and decompress. Other times you need to hop onto the roller coaster of adventure and excitement. It is important that we experience both roller coasters in order to appreciate the ride. Take the time for yourself to be reminded you need to rest your body, your mind, and your soul as it is vital to your physical and mental health. We all need to heal and recoup from everyday stresses and responsibilities. We can put ourselves into a peaceful state by focusing our attention and energy on a hobby or activity that we enjoy. Tapping into our creative side, it allows us to express our feelings and release the negative energy we have built up within ourselves in order to make room for the positive. Whether it be art, carpentry, gardening, cooking, hiking, dancing, singing, or just going into a meditative state for a few moments. It all helps us to open up and welcome the opportunity to get off that roller coaster of life just for a little bit and simply be. Take the time to be who you are in ways you feel most comfortable and excited. Who cares who is watching or what they think or what they will say? You really shouldn't put energy into that. Just do you. Remember, we aren't here to placate other people's opinions and impressions. We are here to embrace ourselves for who we are and who we want to be. Get on the roller coaster of adventure and excitement. Take that ride to feel alive and be proud of yourself for sitting in that seat and buckling up. Appreciate the experience and the lessons you learn about yourself along the way. Think about it. Life is really like a roller coaster. You will have the highs and you will hit the lows and maybe even being upside down. But in order to fully experience them, you have to ride through both. You can get off when things become overwhelming or you can get on when you want the exhilaration of what life has to offer. So get on that roller coaster or get off of it, but do both. And remember, always love yourself and be kind to yourself.